Hey YouTube, I'm about to show you a quick fix that I found in Google Docs the presentation. It's kind of Google Docs um, uh, PowerPoint, if you will. I was trying to cast to a TV like a PowerPoint presentation or a Google Docs uh, presentation uh, to a TV, but also have the presenter view on the computer and I could not get it to work through uh, Chromecast, but I found a way to do it and I'm going to show you how to do it. So I'm going to cast to a TV my presentation for the audience, and I'm going to be able to keep the presenter view on uh, the computer that I'm working on. So here goes. All right, I'm not super tech savvy, so you're going to have to see it old school here. Okay, here's my computer right here, and I have Google, uh, my Google Drive open. There's some of my uh, Google uh, Docs stuff there. There's the TV that I'm trying to cast to. As you can see, there's just a Chromecast screen. Uh, right there. So I go here and what I want to do is say I want to cast uh, this this thing here that says practice. So I I click on it, I open it up. Um, there's the slides loading up right there. And so I want to cast this over to here. Well, what I would do is I would go over here to this thing right over here called slideshow. So I go to slideshow and I go to here and I want a presenter view. So what happens is I get that. There's my presenter view right there. Sorry, I know this is kind of blurring and everything, but there it is, the presenter view where I can do my working and I can, uh, you know, just choose the next slide and all that type of stuff. And behind that is the actual presentation. Well, I want to get that over to that screen, okay? All right, so how do I do that? I go over, basically it's kind of like two windows are open here. I go over here to this window, I click on it, and I hit that share button right there. When I hit share, I hit cast, and then I'm going to cast it to the, that that's the name of the TV, GWC Children TV. So when I cast it, here's what happens. I hit the cast button, boom. All right, now, so it cast over there. Great, everything's wonderful, right? Yeah, no, everything's not wonderful. Why? Because I lost my presenter view <laughs> and it's nowhere to be found. It disappears when you do that. So I've tried everything. I found a quick trick. I won't talk you through all the trouble that I went through to do this. I'm gonna hit the escape key. You see, see what I have here? So I'm going to hit the escape key. When I hit the escape key, boom, I hit the escape key. When I did that, that screen turned back to that, to like where I edit the slides. And look, that screen did it too. That's the only way I've been able to keep that screen up there is by hitting that escape key. So once I hit that escape key, I do that. Now, by way of luck, I hit the escape key. And then I thought, you know what? I'm going to try the presenter view again. So I hit the presenter view again. When I hit the presenter view, boom, the presenter view comes up on my computer and look what happened there. That went to a presentation mode and the presenter view came back up on my computer. Now I can do the presenter view and what I can do is I can go here, let me get my mouse here, and I'm gonna, that's the next slide there. When I hit next, it advanced. To the next one here, the next slide is going to be, I'm going to hit next, it's going to be a black screen. I'm going to hit next, it's going to be the next screen. So the presenter view is actually working. That is the only way I have found to use your laptop as the presenter view and your secondary screen through Chromecast as the presentation whatever uh, monitor. So anyway... I got lucky how I came across that. I have looked all over YouTube and everywhere else to try to figure that out, and I have not found that anywhere. All right, there you have it. Um, I hope I explained that okay. Sorry that I don't have all the technology that some of you guys have, but <laughs> but it got it done. So anyway, um, if you have any questions, I'm so bad I don't even know how to answer them. So, uh, but you can try to ask me questions if you want, and I hope you guys have a good day, and I hope this video is helpful. It was very helpful for me. See ya.